Hello, sixth graders. Welcome to Big Ideas Math, Contract Math, Section 2.6, 2012 edition, Solving Two-Step Equations Activity. Pause while you write Section 2.6, 2012 Activity in your math notebook. Pause again while you write today's activity objective, Solve a Two-Step Equation Using Algebra Tiles in your math notebook. Today we're going to be working on page 49 in your Record and Practice Journal. Our first example is solving a two-step equation. Use algebra tiles to model and solve 2x minus 3 equals negative 5. Model the equation 2x minus 3 equals negative 5. Draw a sketch of your tiles. I've drawn it for you below. Be sure you copy that into your record and practice journal. Our next step is to remove the three red tiles on the left side by adding and we are going to write three yellow tiles to each side. I'll show you what that looks like, and then you can sketch that in your record and practice journal. Now we're going to remove the three zero pairs from each side. So those just go away. And then because there are two green tiles, we divide the red tiles into two equal groups. I'll show you what that looks like, and then you copy that into your record and practice journal. So we're going to keep one of the groups. That shows the value of x, and we draw a sketch of the remaining tiles. I'm going to show that for you, and then you copy it into your record and practice journal. So as you can see, x, our variable here, equals negative 1. So let's write that in our spot. Now we're going to look at example 2, which shows us the math behind the tiles. So if you weren't using algebra tiles, this is how you would solve the problem in example 1. So it says, solve 2x minus 3 equals negative 5 without using algebra tiles, and describe each step which step is first, adding 3 to each side or dividing each side by 2? So if you look at page 82 in your math book, which is online for you at Big Ideas Math, um, you can see this example played out for you, but I'm going to help you with it here. So your first step is to write the equation, as always. So 2x minus 3 equals negative and then your second step, just like we did with the algebra tiles, would be to add 3 to each side. So we would have 2x minus 3 plus 3 equals negative 5 plus 3. So our negative 3 and our plus 3 cancel each other out, they become 0, and then we have 2x equals negative 5 plus 3, which equals a negative 2. And then we divide each side by 2, so we have 2x divided by 2 equals negative 2 divided by 2. 2x divided by 2 equals 1, so that equals an x, and negative 2 divided by 2 equals a negative 1, so x equals negative 1. And the first step was adding 3 to each side. Now we're going to move on to page 50 in your Record and Practice Journal. And it says to write an equation shown by the algebra tiles. It says use algebra tiles to model and solve the equation. So we're just going to work it out and check your answer by solving the equation without using algebra tiles. So here we go. Letter A, if we look at the equation, we have two variables, so we'll call that 2x, 2x 
and we have two pluses, so that's plus two equals, we have six minuses, so that's negative six. And in order to get the positive two on the left to go away, we need to subtract it from both sides. So we have two, two x plus two minus two equals negative six minus two. So that gives us on the left hand side two x equals negative eight. And then we're going to divide both sides by two in order to make the two that's attached to my x go away. So that's multiplied by my x go away. So we're multiplying here. We want to do an inverse operation, so we're going to divide. So 2x divided by 2 equals negative 8 divided by 2. So x equals negative 4. Now, your job tonight is going to be to do letter B on your own. Your assignment tonight is to complete letter B in Activity 3 on page 50 of your Record and Practice Journal. Show your work and be prepared to share during our next class. Remember, to earn credit for viewing this flipped lesson, you need to complete your exit slip, come to our next class prepared with the journal pages or other work from the flipped lesson completed, be prepared with any work that was assigned in the flipped lesson completed, and be prepared with any questions you have for your teacher, and of course, have a good attitude.